So we're gonna crack Kaldheim set set booster box here. Let's see how this goes. I'm most excited for the set cards and some of those uh, beautiful showcase frames that they have. I really wish they'd had a box stopper in these. It really made the Zendikar Rising set booster boxes really pop off. Or be duds, but they were still cool nonetheless. So before we get cracking, let's roll the beautiful die. Let's see what happens. So we've got, we've got 30 packs. Set this off to the side. So one in four packs, we get a chance. Got a set at a list card. Let's see how these set boosters go. The Zendikar Rising were pretty fun to crack. No, no boost list card on that one. That is a cool art, though. I do like that. So, fair goth. Snow covered forest. Vega. Nico. Reflections of Lit Jara. Frank Hark. All right. Nothing too spicy on the first one. I know we've run a list card. Will it be a big one? Ooh, beautiful. That is very nice. Tibble's trickery art. The giant ox is funny. Iron verdict. Oh, looks like we've got an extended art back there. Let's try and hide it. Oh, and an extended art Nico Eris. That is very cool indeed. Very, very nice. Very nice. So we'll set the Mythics there. Ice Eye Troll, nothing special. Draugr Thought Thief, and Shambling Shell. Nothing important there. Let's see here. We'll change where those are stacked. We'll put them right there in that corner. That Nico Eris is beautiful though. No list, but that's alright. Ooh, a Sarolf. Gold signature. Very nice. Snow covered island. I almost want to keep saying, ooh, we've got a foil, but it's a foil in every pack. It's peeking out every time. A storm predator. Nothing special there. Ice bind pillar. Smashing success. Well, so far, relatively meh. Let's keep going. No list card. Actually, there's no way, no easy way to open these packs without revealing whether you get a list card or not. I do really like the art cards. Ingaruna eyes, Rune of Might, Weather Runestone, Faceless Haven. Ooh, did I see something there that I want? I do, so that's gonna go straight in my Akiri deck. So we'll put that right about there. It goes over a little bit. Battlefield Raptor, nothing special there. Very nice. I do like that I got that coal. I was going to have to buy one. No list card. Very nice art card. Ooh, a foil snow covered swamp. Got a deck for that to go straight into. 
Finn. Binding of the Old Gods. A showcase redeem the god a god of the worthy Prospigetti. And a foil showcase. Vega. There. That was, that was an okay pack. Nothing spectacular yet. Treasure token. Very nice art. Another nice art card. Let's see here. Again, I see that foil peeking out. Crippling fear. Hellstorm out. We got two of those almost back to back. An elder fang. Nothing special there. So, crippling fear. Choose a creature type. Creatures that are that chosen type get negative three, negative three till end of turn. No list. Lower on list this time, it feels like. Ooh, nice. Very nice art card again. Far Avenger, Harold, another one. Right. Well, Skim Far Avenger, another non elf token, or non token elf dies. Nothing too special in that one. Best pull so far is definitely still that Nico Eris. Only one mythic in. That's relatively disappointing so far. Ooh, I do really like that art. Let's see, let's see. I'm gonna go through these pretty quick. Army Broken Bow, Bow? Bro, Brow, wow. Uh, Resplendent Marshall. And, ooh, there's a list card. I missed it. Chemistry's Insight, nothing too terribly spectacular there. Rare. And another mythic there. Splendid Marshall. Um, huh. Nah. It's decent. It doesn't feel like a mythic though. Let's see here. Some of these arts are just. The art in this set is, is top notch. Fiera, Calamity Bearer, Bergstrider, Behold the Multiverse, very good card. Alright, All right. we're going to be a third of the way through here. Ten packs in, two list cards, so definitely feels lighter on the list cards. And there's our art card for the pack. Beautiful art. Alvar, going straight in the Akiri deck. More Dite, that's my second one of those. And our foil, Magda. I think I know somebody that might want one of those. Well, that was a good pack. Foil Mythic, and a, or a Mythic and a Foil Ring. Shard. So this is what... Nico's, Nico Eris gives you it's a token enchantment. Sacrifice, tap and sacrifice, or pay two, sacrifice. This enchantment, scry one and draw a card. Ooh, Alrond. Very cool. Let's set that off over there. I really do like the art cards, like I said before. They are just cool to have. Ascendant Spirit, kind of a meh. But a Bergy Showcase. That is awesome. That will be going in my Kai Card deck for sure. Very cool. Frostbite, Infernal Pet, the Bergy. Ah, oh, that's just beautiful. Let's take a look at that again. Look at that. Just beautiful. All right. 
is just too good not to go in high car. Treasure token. Oh, beautiful art. I am surprised how many of these dual lands we get. These dual snow lands. Scent of the Worthy, Great Hall of Starheim, Rampage of the Valkyries, our first rare saga, Battle for Redguard. We got another we got Finn, the Fang Bearer, and Bergstrider Foil. Not setting the foils to the side in this one. Alright, we are definitely hurting on list cards. Look at that. Another non list card pack. But the art sure does make up for it, it feels like almost. And we got a foil snow covered mountain. Another one. Another uh, rare saga, Bears of Litjara. Another Vega the Watcher, that's my third. And Bears of Litjara. Nothing special there. Doomscar Titan Foil. Meh. Let's see. Oh, we do have a list for sure. Let's see what happens when we get there. Huggy Mob. Snow Covered Swamp. Need it for a deck. Elvish Warmaster. Grand Draugr. Shackles of Treachery. So let's set our rare to the side real fast. And our list card. What is it going to be? Oh, that's cool. I don't think it's great, but it's cool. It's at least a cool card. Not a great list card, but a cool card. So no rares from the list yet. Two, two uncommons. Feels like they definitely scaled back on how many list cards you get. But we'll see. Beautiful art. Just beautiful. See here, Valkyrie Sword, that might actually go in at Kiri. Shepherd of the Cosmos, Hinge Gate Pathway, very nice. And Scorn Effigy, all right, that's, that's an okay pack, not a great pack. We're not, got, nah, man, not nearly as many multi-rare packs as I was getting in those Zendikar Rising boosters, set booster boxes. Okay, both of them I open had or rare or mythic packs. Mast Vandal. Burning Rune Demon. Mistwalker. And again, just kind of a standard draft booster, it feels like. Have a list card for sure. What's our art? Very nice. Beautiful art. Sorry about the glare. Mast Vandal. Reckless Crew. Waking the Trolls. Valkyrie Hunter. Alright, so there's a three rare pack. Not amazing rares, but still cool. C3 rares in a pack. And our list card looks like it's a red card. Wild Research. That's new to me. One in a white. Search your library for an enchantment card. And reveal that card. Put it in your hand. And then discard a card at random from your hand. One in a blue. Search your library for an instant card. Put it in your hand. And discard a card at random. Well, that's interesting. It's usable, maybe. A repeatable tutor is never necessarily a bad thing. Another list card. So we're going to run a list card apparently. That's going to be my list rare. It seems like you get one rare list card. <coughs> Excuse me there. I had to 
sneeze. Tyvar Kell. Huh, so far the only art card that's portrait instead of landscape. Let's see what this brings. There's that Haggy Mob. Doomscar Titan in search of greatness. Svela and Immerstorm and Goblin Lord. Draw four cards. Put them into your hand and discard three cards at random. Swamps as I can get. A Seeker's Chariot. That's actually my second one of those. Right there. And straw for skim form. Nothing amazing. So far, pretty. Eh, if not amazing, at least fun. Boost rolling. No huge bombs yet. This one I can't recall. Gates of Isfel. Snowfield Sinkhole. Alright, let's go through this pack here. Svela, Replicating Ring, Bellwatch Collar, Rise of the Dreadmar. Definitely needed another one of those. Ooh, Priest of the Haunted Edge, and a Foil Showcase. Inga Runeyes. Goes. There's Cole, Forge Master. Harold, Mystic Reflection, that's cool. Canopy Tactician, we got some elves. Pilfering Hawk Foil. A list card. We're into the last set. Let's hope we get some bombs here. What is that one? It is Svela. I should have known that. Very nice. Sorry, I had to make sure I was still recording here. Raven's Warning. Replicating Ring. Blood Sky Berserker. Nothing amazing there. Oh, forgot to put my coal in my stack of art. No list card, but a coma's coil. Shall we pull a coma? That would be beautiful. Let's see here. Dragon Skin Berserker. Vicious Return, Showdown of the Skulls, Sculptor of Winters, Cold Spell Cleric. Alright, let's see here. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven left. So we're nearing the end. Oh, we got a list. We got a list. Can it be something huge? I did manage to pull a chain bell in Zendikar Rising, which was cool. Jorga Showcase. And, oh, Ethereum Horn Sculptor. I actually think I pulled this in my Zendikar Rising. Yeah, fairly sure I did. That's funny. Oof. 
harder. Third Island. Forging the Tyrite Sword. Dwarven Hammer. Blood on the Snow. More tight. Mm, nothing big there. A list card. So the planeswalker hurts. Must be portrait. That would make sense. We got one planeswalker so far. Definitely seem to. Well, since War of the Swart, tone, tone down how many you get in a pack. Or how many you get in a box. Cosmos Elixir, Fursia, or Furia, Furia, whatever. What's there? I feel like I've matched a couple showcases that should go in that pile, but. Oh well. No list card. Maybe down to three packs after this. Nico Aris to match. Does it mean a nice pack here? Tibalt's Trickery. Second of those. Old Growth Troll. Cert Land Flinger, oof. Boreal Outrider, Elf Warrior. Alright. Can we get at least one more of this card? Not in this pack, we want. I think we've met our list cards. Quota for the pack, for the box. Sulfurous Mire, Foil. Bloody Massacre. And that was it. You know, I really think they should at least have two guaranteed rares or something in these set booster packs. Oh, a list card. I'm going to be above quota for this. These packs do not want to let go. They just don't. Art in this set is just amazing. The set itself might not be amazing, but the art is. Akaya, very cool. Maha uh -huh, and demonic gifts and oh, a Vesuva. As Vesuva comes into play, choose a land in play. If you do, Vesuva becomes a copy. Comes into play tapped. Comes into play tapped as a copy of the chosen land. So three rare list cards, and I like that one. I'm going to have to find a place for that. I'm sure. There you go, somewhere. All right. Last pack. I don't know. We shall see. It doesn't want to come apart at all. There we go. No list. Not surprising. See how it is here. Akaya is cool. Angel Warrior, very nice. And our last one is Eradicator Valkyrie. Very pretty. Just I love the colors. Dragon Ackermancer. Reflection of Litjara. Agar. Cosmos Charger Foil. Very nice. Well, that was, that was a decent pack to end it. Well, I hope everybody enjoyed that. I'm not going to give you the normal spiel that everybody else does. If you enjoyed it, good. If not, I apologize. Thanks for everybody that did watch. Have a wonderful night or a wonderful day.